Hello, welcome back to my channel, and welcome back to Undertale. Now, it's been a long time since I've actually recorded another episode of this. I don't even remember what episode it is. But, if I look through my files here, um, okay, should be episode 3 here now. The last one we actually went through, we actually had to kill, well, Papyrus, honestly. He was not much of a big deal. This is a no offense thing, Papyrus was not by far hard. But we murdered him, there's nothing left of him, we can continue. Can we kill anybody else here? Uh, it's so peaceful and quiet. Usually one of these skeleton chases my little cinnamon around. Okay, so I'm not going to be able to kill anybody here yet. But I don't believe, actually, I believe that we'll be able to kill somebody else here soon. Can we go in here? It's locked. Okay. It's locked from the inside, which is still retarded by far. Which I've noticed. Doesn't these actually kind of look like little skulls, honestly, if you look at them the right way? Intentional, maybe? Who knows? But we are back going through here once more. Now. I have no idea what to expect going forward. Yo, are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome. She's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. Okay, still same reaction there. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. And just like before, this is an echo flower. Yeah, just piece what it says over and over. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. Yes, might as well save here while we are at it. There's a door behind there, it seems, that I can't get access to. Didn't catch that until this run, evidently. This is a box. You can put an item in or take an item out. Why would you, though? You can't use items when they're in the box. Sincerely, a box hater. Yes, um, let's see what do we have. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing to put in there. Evidently, I stocked up in a bunch of healing items. Wait, but can I go across here? I remember there being a waterfall that we can actually go through. What's this? There's a tutu line on the ground. You take it. Take it. You got the old tutu. Okay. How many combos you can do with that one? Let's see. Uh, info. Let's see. Armor 10. Finally, a protective piece of armor. Okay, so armor defense of 10. In my defense is that of a naturally 1, 7. Okay, so this should actually bump me up. Use equipped old tutu. And if I actually look at my stats, oh yeah, by far is it making me stronger. Okay, let's see. Use the box, yes. Manly bandana goes up until I get until I sell it. Does these push me here? No. Okay. What's it say? I don't remember. It's a. I'm sorry. I swore I saw something behind that rushing water. Okay, so it's supposed to be just a clue. Huh? There's a camera behind this waterfall. Okay, so playing f through the past is one makes so much more fucking sense. Alpha has been actually watching us the entire time, as she mentioned, but there was hidden cameras that we can actually interact to find. Gotcha. Well. Unexpected. Didn't catch it until now. <coughs> well. Undyne's gonna be a pain in the ass.
Definitely. Oh shit. <coughs> yeah, the first time I befriended you and now I'm gonna have to kill you. And this is gonna be a pain in the ass on my hands. Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome. I'm so jealous. She was just standing there waiting forever. And then you just... Come on. Let's go watch you beat up some bad guys. Dude, really? A feeling of dread hangs over you. But you stand, but you stay determined. Okay, so... Oh, yeah. Bullshit here. Gotcha. I didn't mean for it to go over there. Hopefully three is enough. No, it's not. Oh, shit. You know, I could cut the video here and actually train up probably really good to the save area, like right out there. But who cares? I'm gonna die anyways. Okay, there we go. So we're six minutes in it seems. Almost seven now, and we're getting pretty far now. Aaron flexes in. I don't fuck I'm supposed to press Z repeatedly for that. Forgot about that. My bad. It's been a while. Come on, in the water is fine. Okay. Get the proper wood for them. Fuck, I still fucked that one up. There you go, you're dead. And it's some experience. And that's pretty much all I need at the moment. I may have mentioned this before, but I remember I remember that later on we get a real knife. We don't really get to use it for much, but when we actually get access to it, we can actually spare anybody just because. And that's because monsters are afraid of it. So there's a bell here. Okay, so the bell resets it. I don't remember if I'm having that there, so, yeah. It's probably one of those things I missed until now, and if I would've only fucking knew, it would've saved me so much fucking trouble. But, hey, whatever. I made a fuck up, probably. Don't remember. Personally, I'm not gonna go through each one of these again. Wash your shuffles up. Oh, that almost glued. Your soul is unclean. No shit. Yeah, fuck. Well. I can spare you, but fuck you. You're dead. Okay. Let's see here. Yes, use the telescope. Check wall. Check wall. Okay, so just check wall. So yeah, through here, I don't remember. I did not mean to interact with that. Oh yeah, fuck it was this wall. Okay, a common sense thing and I'm pretty much just fucking up big time. Okay. I'm so not actually wanting to actually face her right now. She's gonna fucking destroy my ass. At least I got an idea of what to do, so. Shit. No point in me even trying to actually 
There's no way I'm gonna be able to fucking dodge those when I get hit. God damn it. Down to 11. You really need to take a chill pill. I'm not killing you yet. Okay, and you're not gonna find me, but I'm gonna have to try to kill him. Whatever the fuck his name was again, I don't remember. Yeah, he's like rubble. I have to say, he's probably more akin to like a goblin from most things. But hey, whatever. Yo, did you see that? Undying just touched me. I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky if you were standing just a little bit to the left? Yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. Fucking knows the chain like hell. Okay, so... What was this again? This cheese has been there so long, a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. Well... Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the magical crystal. It fills you with determination. Okay, so... It's an odd looking telescope. Yeah, I can't do anything with that, so... Let's see. Yes, no... It's a box for storing punch cards is empty right now. I have plenty of items, so I don't need them. The ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors, okay? Nothing happened. Well, lovely. What do you have to say? What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? Oh. What's this way? Okay, the duck. Gotcha. So... I'm not sure if I'm actually still playing the genocide run correctly. I know there's two ways to go about it. You're supposed to kill everybody. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? Yes. Okay, so... If I check this, uh, weapon damage 7. And my stats are 5. So, yeah, that would greatly increase my damage. Equip the ballet shoes. So I'm gonna basically beat people in the head with them. Gotcha. So, down we go! Honestly, from a little bit of research I have done in the past, I have learned that if you ultimately actually go through the game, you you face Chara and, and have to decide to destroy or not, you have to destroy the world or not, and in doing so, that's your choice to do, but it's going to be destroyed no matter what, pretty much. So, you are relatively more complicated on how you're supposed to actually be attacked. Gotcha. Okay, oh, originally when I actually first played this game, I thought it was going to be a lot easier in some regard. By attacking, I never actually expected it to be like this. Varying between creature to creature. So, can I possibly kill you? Oh no, hey, there. Noticed you were here. I'm. Anisan. Anisan, you here? Can I kill you? 
You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's a gr it's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. Okay. Even though the water's getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time. But hey, hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium, like all my friends did. And the aquarium full anyway, so even if I want to, I... That's okay though, you hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? Seriously, the Yahir needs to quit. Hey, there. That's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. In Waterfall. Okay. Whatever. So, what's... Okay, so... Okay, oh yeah, you're the singing one. You won. Wait, what the fuck? Your love increased. So what, did I level up? Yeah, I did. Sweet. What's the right? Let's see. Is there anything? Nope, nothing for the description here. I need an umbrella for that. To get into this area here. What was it again? Nope. Uh, I don't remember. Fuck. Yeah, um... What was it again? Guess I gotta get an umbrella from here. Please take one. Gotcha. Yes, take an umbrella. I'm gonna set it here so we can possibly get the dog residue or whatnot. Yes. Inside the statue, a music box begins to play. Was there anything we had to wait here and eventually would actually show up? Okay, yeah, it's O up. So it's, yeah. Dot up right, dot down down right. Dot up right, dot down down right. I need to try to remember that. It was dot up right dot down down right right wait let me play that again actually it was yes dot up right down down right. okay so it's actually like the main theme there okay that makes so much more sense it's a legendary artifact will you take it yes you're carrying too many dogs Annoying dog, okay. Can we potentially go back and fill up a chest? That's something I got a question of. We can fill up a chest for that. Let's use you actually out here. Okay, we only have you there. Fuck. What the fuck is that artifact for? Here, let me actually Google this. I'm not actually using my phone for too much right now. So, let's see... Here, Undertale. Yeah, artifact. What is it for? The artifact room. This is something I've never been able to actually figure out. Let's see, the artifact room. Let's see. The artifact room is a secret location found in Waterfall. It is accessible after solving a piano puzzle. There's a description. Okay, attempting to retrieve the artifact promotes the message you're carrying too many dogs. And the annoying dog appears 
in the protagonist's inventory for this room only. When the annoying dog is dropped or used, it appears walking from the leftmost visible point from where it is dropped. Absorbs the artifact and walks off through the right wall until it cannot be seen. Leaving dog residue in the protagonist's inventory. Interacting with the residue after the artifact is absorbed brings up text. The artifact is gone. Okay, so it's literally just nothing but to get the dog residue. That makes so much sense, honestly. Take it, yes. Carrying too many dogs. I know I'm not going to be able to do much for it here, but use. You deployed the annoying dog. The dog absorbed the artifact. Yeah, and then you pull some, like, god shit there and walk through the wall. Okay, so there literally is nothing there besides the dog residue. Good to know. I may have covered this beforehand, but I don't remember. That it. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. So, let's see. We don't need an umbrella, honestly. But, we have dog residue, correct? Yes. Yo, you can't hold an umbrella either. If you're walking anyway, I guess I'll go with you. Let's go. Personally, I can hold an umbrella, but you're gonna walk in the rain. Because my cold black heart will cause me to kill you. Man, Undead is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night, knowing she was gonna beat me up. Well, um, you're gonna die, so... Yeah. So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. They got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undying came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. Um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. Innocent is the keyword there because by far is this character not innocent. Because, dear God. What do you have to say? Nothing? Okay. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, my mouth is fucking me bad, so my mouth keeps actually fucking with me. Apologies with that. Well, more my throat's fucking with me with that. Yo! This ledge is way too steep. Yo, you wanna see Undyne, right? Climb on my shoulders. Okay. Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. Okay, so, so far we've only killed creatures that have actually attacked us. The serene sound of a distant music box. It fills you with determination. So this is area 9. One thing I've noticed about, well, level 9, I'm level 9. Uh, they, I noticed they really show the level a lot. I don't know exactly why they call the level love in some regards, but, hell. That's at least from my pacifist run, so. I can't blame you too much for this. Yeah. Yeah, shit. I'm not even gonna fucking try to run when this happens. Okay, this is easier to dodge, I'll admit. What way was it? I believe it was up. 
Okay, it didn't fucking matter. There we go. We'll get in there. What happens they don't want to take a chance? Fuck! Almost dodged that one. Shit! Wrong way! Down! Down! Yeah, shit. Oh, fuck. I went the wrong way again, shit! Fuck, I thought I was out of the range of that. Yep. If I get like two more times, I'm dead. I tried to get out of the way. I can't use items. Careful, 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 careful. No! Shit! Careful, 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 fuck! God damn it. Do I have to go through all this bullshit again? Yes, I know. God damn it. But I wish I could fucking use my healing items. Okay, so... I need to pause for a moment. Okay, so that's done. I can't really do that just yet. Okay. Sorry, um, and some encoding I was doing on a video for editing just kind of finish. so, yeah. Which, okay. Don't get caught, that's all I need to do. If you get caught once, I'm probably going to get caught like 50 million times. Truthfully, this is the thing here. How in the hell are you able to tell exactly where we're at, pretty much? Shit, long way. Well, they still. Okay, that was close. At least I know roughly where I'm going now. Because I really didn't remember. But now I do. Somewhat. Okay, seems to be starting to speed up now. Okay, so... There we go. Go through the area. Let's keep walking forward. And this is gonna suck. Gotta go back. Am I right? I gotta go back, or...? Yeah, I gotta go back. Well, turn of events. Okay, so... Well, now we fall down. And there we go. We're gonna be facing Undyne as this episode, aren't we? It sounds like it came from over here. Oh, you've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here, get up. Ven, huh? That's a nice name. My name is... I th think the entire part there is a lost memory kind of thing. It kind of makes a lot more sense now, honestly. It's a memory of your... whoever the fuck you named your character, honestly. In this case, Ven, basically, when we went to the past with Ven, you find out Asriel was friends with... this called Ven, and long story short, if you haven't seen it, it's just better for you to go watch it, but you all have to save the day, and you pretty much just become a god at certain points. And, and, well, really, when, you, when you're when you level 1 with unlimited hit points, it's kind of a broken thing. It's broken for any level, but damn, really, level 1? The waterfall here seems to flow from the ceiling of the cavern. Occasionally, a piece of trash will flow through. 
and fall into the bottomless abyss below. Viewing this endless cycle of worthless garbage fills you with determination. Yes, we will save! Oh yeah, it's you. Seems like a real or training dummy. Do you want to beat it up? Yes. You punch the dummy at full force. Feels good. <coughs> okay. <coughs> Fool, do you think you can hurt me? I am a ghost that lives inside a dummy. My cushion used to live, sorry, my cousin used to live inside a dummy too until you destroyed their home. Us ghosts spend our whole lives looking for a proper vessel. Slowly, slowly, we grow closer to our new bodies until one day we too may become corporal beings. Being able to laugh, love, and dance like any other. But you, my cousin's future, you took it all away. Despicable, despicable, despicable human. I hope you're not too attracted to your body. Sorry, attached to your body. Because your soul's about to get infected bites, whatever. <laughs> Is it because what we did didn't destroy the dummy beforehand? There you go. Foolish fool! Sorry, foolish, foolish, foolish. Even if you attack my vessel, you'll never hurt me. I'll still... Sorry, I'm still in corporal, you dummy. Wait. A dummy? A compliment? Eh, yeah, shit. Fuck. I gotta get him to attack you. Let's see, one, two, three. Me. Pitiful, pitiful, pitiful. There we go. Ow, you dummies. Watch where you're aiming your magic attacks. Hey, you. Forget I said anything about magic. I get it. I get it. One, two, three. There we go. I'll defeat you and take your soul. Mad Dummy is hopping mad. There you go. I'll be doing this. I'll use your soul to cross the barrier. <coughs> you know, shit, he's hopping mad. Very critical man. I'll stand in the window of a fancy store. Yeah, you're getting your ass kicked. Mad Bo sorry, Mad Dummy is bossing around its bullets. There you go. Keep doing this. Then everything I want will be mine. Very too easy. Mad Dummy is getting cotton all over its dialogue box. There we go. Get it. Uh, yeah, I guess that I'll avenge my cousin. There you go. My dummy's getting caught in all of them. Um, yeah, same thing. What was their name again? Dude, really? You don't even fucking know your cousin's name. You want to get pissed about him? Whatever, whatever, whatever!
There you go. Okay, so... Seems just... You're screwed. Futile, futile, futile! Okay. My dummy is getting caught all over uh, the dialogue box. Yeah. There you go. How many times do I gotta do this? Before you fucking give up? Feeble, feeble, feeble! Okay. What's that in this? No, fuck, never mind. Okay, and attack. There you go. Feeble, feeble, feeble. There you go. Hey, guys! Dummies! 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 Remember how I said not to shoot at me? Well, futile! You're fired! You're all being replaced! <coughs> Dude, chill. <laughs> now you'll see my true power. Relying on people that aren't garbage. Mechanical wires fill the room. It's a dummy bot magic missile, okay? Yeah, oh, shit, I missed. Eh, my bad. Okay, so he wants him to try again. There you go, all of them, like, almost all of them. Mad Dummy is bossing around the bullets. Again. Yeah. Dude. Did I hit you any? I hope so, because that was not worth the effort. Mad Dummy is doing an armless ska, ska dance. Okay. Is the game locked up? Okay. No, my controller disconnected. Shit. Let me restart my controller. I, have a I always record with it plugged up to my computer. So, fuck. He's still on there? Okay. Thank God. Okay. There we go. I was wondering why I wouldn't do anything. Okay, now it won't do anything. Well, shit. Um. Yeah, um. Everything's yeah, a little broken. Um. Does that work? My dummy is doing an armless sky dance. Okay, so you need to be X, you need to be Z, try this, there we go, well this needs to be control, gotcha, and one last thing, save that, apology just stopped working all of a sudden. There we go. Final attack, you say? I fucked that up. Yeah, shit. I missed you entirely. N no way. These guys are even worse than the other guys. Who cares, who cares, who cares? I don't need friends. I've got knives. Okay, dude. Dude, miss. I'm out of knives. But it doesn't matter. You can't hurt me, and I can't hurt you. I'll be stuck fighting. You'll be stuck fighting me forever. 
Forever. Forever! Okay, dude. Ah, what? What the heck is this? An acid rain? Oh, forget it. I'm out of here. Sorry, I interrupted you, didn't I? As soon as I came over, your friend immediately left. Oh no, you guys looked like you were having fun. Oh wait, don't you attack me? Didn't you attack me before? Oh, that's awkward. Sorry. Have a nice day. Well, I'm going to head home now. Just warning you so you don't accidentally follow me to my house. You probably wouldn't like that. Dude, look at extreme depressant. Depressive guy. Whatever. So, how long have I been recording? Eh, I got time. A little more time, roughly. Oh, hey. Sorry. Oh, hey. You followed me. My house is up here. So, you probably won't want to come this way. Hope that happens. Oh, well, let's see. You f feel a calming tranquility. You're filled with determination. Okay, this way's a duck up here. There's no dying tiles. What? 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 It's a living... If I could kill you, I'd kill you. Why? Because. But this way... Is not what I can do anything with dog was to do. Let's see. Yes. Let's put that and that in there. But actually... Okay. Can't do anything here just yet. So let's continue. One thing I will want to do is actually gather a fuck ton of gold. Well, money. Double G, so I'm saying gold. I don't remember if it's actually gold or not. But I want to get to the point of facing Undyne this episode. That's just it. So it's going to be a bit longer of an episode. And. Of course, next episode, I'll be actually fully going through and probably buying some more items by spending more gold. Can I go anywhere this way? No, gotta go back. Okay. Timmy appears. Here to defeat you. You wanna earn 40, and 50 gold. Okay. We just killed Timmy. <laughs> Is she dead? I believe it's a she. Yeah, is she dead? That's my only question. Okay. I'm gonna go check the shop now. I may just fuck myself over. This is the proper way, I believe. Okay, we continue going. So this way... And... No. Okay, this thing fucking goes quickly. Yep. There you go, you're dead. You didn't even fucking try. You're a bit tougher. Slime sounds, okay. Yeah, fuck. Caught me scratching my head. This is so much easier than trying to actually just befriend everybody, honestly. By far is it easier. Fuck, 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 fuck. Um, over this way. There we go. The Timmy Village is somewhere around here. Okay, not this way. Fuck it, we're here. We might as well fucking do it. I'll go back and I'll find out later. Keep going, keep going. Behind you. Seven. Seven human souls. 
with the power of a seven sorry of seven human souls or king king asgore dreamer will become a god with that power asgore can finally shatter the barrier he will finally take the surface back from humanity and give them back the suffering and pain that we have endured understand human this is your only chance add redemption give up your soul or I'll tear it from your body dude Undyne, I'll help you fight. Yo, you did it. Undyne is right in front of you. You've got, sorry, you've got front row seats to her fight. It's the moment when it dawns on him. Wait, who's she fighting? Hey, hey you aren't going to tell my parents about this, are you? Okay. Can't go there. So back, I would assume. Yep, there we go. So we're getting close to the fight with Undyne. This should be it, correct? Yo! Yo, I know I'm not supposed to be here, but I want to ask you something. Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, you, so yo, you're human, right? Man, I knew it. Well, I know it now, I mean. Well, um, there's a quick note for timestamps here. Um, yeah, I'm going to go take a piss. So be right back. Um, now we're back here, so I will make sure to remember this time. Undyne told me, um, stay away from that human. So like, um, <clears throat> I guess that makes us enemies or something. But I kind of stink at that. Yo, say something mean so I can hate you, please. Yes. Uh, yo, yeah. that's your idea of something mean. My sister says that to me all the time. Guess I have to do it. Yo, I I hate you, your guts. Man, I I'm such a tard. So I turd. I'm I'm gonna go home now. Yo, wait, help. I tripped. Let's see. You, 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 dude. If, if you want to hurt my friend, you're going to have to get through me first. Okay, I didn't know what I was supposed to do with this one. She's gone. Yo, you really saved my skin. Guess being enemies was just a nice thought. We'll just have to be friends instead. Man, I should really go home. I bet my parents are worried sick about me. Can I attack you by chance? Later, dude. Um... I think I'm missing something. Uh, okay, I'm lost. Massacre run. Kill everybody. Genocide. Uh, seven. Seven human souls. And King Asgore will become a god. Six. That's how many we have collected thus far. Understand? Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, it is customary for those who make it this far. I shall tell you the tragic tale 
of our people. It all started long ago. Can I kill you now? Forget it. Look, Papyrus didn't come to his meeting today. Say what you want about him. He's weird. He's naive. He's self-absorbed. But Papyrus has never missed a meeting. I think finally we're actually getting this to mean something. And no matter what time you call him on the phone, night, day, afternoon, morning, he always answers within the first two rings. But now he's gone, and his brother isn't around either. What did you do to him? What did you do to him, Papyrus, who I have trained every day, even though I know he's too goofy to ever hurt anyone? Go ahead. Prepare yourself to prepare however you want. But when you step forward, I will kill you. So, this is actually a turn of events here. <coughs> Getting choked up a little bit, sorry. <coughs> Fuck. Um, have you ever had one of those moments when you start choking on your own saliva? Never enough to kill you, just enough to make your eyes fucking water like hell. Yeah, <coughs> that's me right now. The wind is howling. You're filled with determination. Okay, let's fuck up on dying. That's it then. No more running away. Here I come. And God. As long as you're green, you can't escape. Unless you learn to face danger head on. You won't last a second against me. This is gonna suck. We've only taken a small slow, not bad. Then how about this? Okay. For years, we've dreamed of a happy ending. Which I'm gonna take away from you. Okay, so... Here. And okay, I can fucking leave that. I've gotten better from last time. You can't tell. <clears throat> I've gotten about a quarter, I won't let you snatch it away from us. Like I said, I've gotten better. I'm not trained, by the way. Enough warming up, just I know what to expect. That's shit. So the one who's just getting his ass handed to him. Ah, uh, you're tough. I can handle the spears. Uh, okay. There we go. But even if you could beat me. So... Yeah. Okay. No human has ever made it past Asgore. Well, from the last playthrough. Ah, I fucked up. I fucked up on heal items though. So stop being so damn resilient. <coughs> yeah, fuck. I fucked up. Might not fuck us, but I've gotten better. What the hell are humans made out of? Flesh, bone, irritation. That's at least what I can say. 81, now that's good. Anyone else would be dead by now. I've leveled up a lot. I'm level 9. I should level up more though. I'm probably not prepared for this. I've done some research and there's one more form after this, I believe. Flower pollen drifts in front of you. That makes almost sense now. Flower's watching. Alpha's told me 
humans are determined. I've played your mind games before and I fall for them a lot. I see now that you meant what you meant by that. Fuck. Fuck. Okay, but I'm determined to. Yeah, shit. I fucked up. What? Die already, you little brat! My brat? Yes. Fuck. Dude! God damn! That filled me up, I need to be maxed. You're getting in my way. No shit, that's my purpose! Okay, dodge the attacks, dodge the attacks. There we go. Undyne flipped her spear impatiently. There we go, 120, damn. I will not be defeated. Oh yeah, this bullshit. And... 106! We're getting stronger! No, oh, we're about to die. <laughs> I mentioned that because I know what's coming next. 126. <clears throat> there. You were stronger than I thought. So then, this is where it ends. No. No. I won't die. Alphas, Asgore, Papyrus. Everyone is counting on me to protect them. Human. In the name of everybody's hopes and dreams, I will defeat you. Undyne looks determined. Come on, is that all you've got? Yeah, shit. You can't just keep doing that, I panic. 108. Pathetic. You're going to have to try harder than that. Tax is slowing down, she's getting weaker. And then its body is wavering. So seeing how strong you are when you believe in yourself. One twenty eight. Had enough yet? You are barely moving. You need to know when to say quits. And then's body is starting to pretty much fall apart. She's gonna fade into nothing. I won't give up. So, just the one. Well. Um, I'm filling up the hit point gauge. That's not good. Alphaz, this is what I was afraid of. This is why I never told you. No. No. Not yet. I won't die. Okay. So, she's... Pissed. I won't die. Only thing I'm missing here is like Super Saiyan Org on there. And then that'd be perfect. What? Um... What the fuck just happened? They're supposed... Um... 
What the fuck? No. Um, this one I've actually learned is supposed to be... You come across, you try to kill the kid, she comes... No. Seriously? This is it? This can't be. It's too late now, obviously. Well, I guess that's it for her. She didn't really put up a fight. Well, okay, the wind has stopped. You're filled with determination. So, we'll level 10 now. Um, thank you all for watching. I will go over and get a bunch of gold, hopefully. Maybe we'll train in like dog residue and some shit. But, any which way, thank you all for watching. Like, comment, subscribe if you wish to. Let me know if any game you'd like to see me play. Please let me know if, and if what the fuck just happened here, if you actually know. Because by far am I confused. Everything I've seen is where you actually have to kill, try to kill the lizard kid. And then that's where things change a bit. You try to kill him. What the fuck did I do wrong? I have no fucking idea. I'm going to have to play through Genocide Run again eventually in the future. So if you have any idea of what the fuck happened, please by far let me know. I am by far confused. Save again just to make sure it's saved correctly. But, yeah. As I said, you're supposed to try to kill the kid. You try to, she jumps in the way. She gets hurt. She's tough enough. You have to try to kill her. And then when she's about to die, she actually transforms into like this utterly powerful badass. So, yeah, once again, thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you in another video.